Sonic, the heart of your system. Hi there guys, Storm here with Kit Guru and we're at the ASUS launch party event. I'm here with Nate. Nate's going to talk us through some of the new products that they're showing off today. So what have we got here today, Nate? So what we're looking at right now is the new 15-inch ZenBook, the UX533. Um, so it is one of our thinnest and smallest ZenBooks um, so far we've ever done. Um, this is actually smaller than our original 13-inch ZenBook, the UX31, from seven years ago. So that's how small and light they're getting. Um, another great feature in the way we've done that is if you look at the display, um, we've got the nano edge display. So 95% of the screen real estate is usable space. Um, so on the whole, it's an absolutely fantastic bit of kit and it's pushing that message of thin, light, powerful performance. It's got an i7, discrete GPU. It's got everything you need for work, play, and also a bit of hard tasking, whether that's Photoshop, or even a light bit of gaming. I was just about to ask you about the specs because usually when, you're, when you have something so small and so light, you end up compromising on certain aspects of it. But you guys have really done quite well with this one here, haven't you? Exactly. So we, like I said, we've got an i7 in there. We've got a, an NVIDIA GTX 1050 Max-Q, um, which gives you all the grunt you need for a lot of day-to-day -day tasks, as well as 16 gigabytes of RAM and a half a, uh, half a terabyte of solid-state storage. Um, so. We've really achieved that through things like the Ergo Lift Hinge to improve cooling, because um, obviously you can get things as small as you want, but they'll run hot and they'll fail to perform. But what we've done, our engineers have worked on making something that is cool, quiet, and therefore can give you that power at all times. As someone looking at getting a new laptop, why, why would this be the one that they should be looking at? So, like I said, it all comes down to portability. I think laptops these days use them for everything, whether it's work, obviously, whether that's sat on the train watching a bit of Netflix, or whether that's goofing off and playing video games and watching YouTube videos in your, in your work time. And the best thing about this is it's portable, it's light, you can take it to work, you can take it to a friend's house, you can take it on holiday. You can do so many great things with this and it doesn't inconvenience you in doing any of them. Now the most important question for a lot of our viewers is going to be, is it out already and how much is it going to set them back? So it's not currently out already. Um, we're looking at opening pre-orders early November, um, so you'll be able to pre-order this now and we're going to have it on shelf a couple of weeks later, so before December definitely. Um, this model here specifically will set you back uh, £1,399, um, but we've got a variety of sizes and specifications starting at 999 And I think I might be correct in saying this is really the star of the show today, right? This is the Novago. Do you want to tell me a little bit about this one? Yeah, so you know, it's the star of the show, it's something new. Um, so the ASUS Novago is a Windows on Snapdragon system. So as you can see from the screen, it runs that familiar Windows experience that everyone knows. It's not Android, it's not Apple. It keeps it nice, simple, and user-friendly. But by running it on Snapdragon, you get a bunch of really useful improvements. Most notably, the fact that if you have this on standby, it'll last for 30 days, but will still instantly turn on every time. Or if you're watching video using the device, you'll get a solid 22 hours of it. And as you can see, if we like fold it down, beautiful sleek form factor. It's as beautiful as any other device we sell. And it's a two in one. So if we open it up, straight away, it's on, it's in tablet mode. You can use this for anything you want, whether it's watching videos on your lap on the train. You could probably present in front of four or five people with this. Or like I said, use it as a normal laptop. So it is a fantastic device. So this has, if I'm correct, this has a Qualcomm processor. They're pretty famous for their, their mobile data speeds. So how fast is this exactly going to be in the UK? So working with the Snapdragon 835 processor, um, it can go up to one gigabit per second LTE. Now that's not something that's currently available in the UK, but that is head and shoulders above any internet speed you'll get. So with this and the 24 gig data sim that we're going to bundle with it on the EE fastest network, you will be able to max out the data speeds anywhere you go. And the best thing is, it's portable and it's got a great battery life. So when you go on holiday, you go to somewhere like Taiwan, you go to America where those speeds are available, you pop in a local sim and you are good to go on the fastest data connections in the world. So comparing this to your Zenbook 13, 14, 15, who is this aimed at? Who, who would be looking to buy this? So this is aimed at a professional on the go or someone that 
travels a lot that doesn't do anything demanding with their device. You know, because it's a Snapdragon processor, because it is a very small light device, you're not going to be able to crunch through photo processing. You're not going to be able to play the latest games. It's not what this is aimed for. This is aimed for people that are busy, active, always out and about, and need something they don't need a charger for. Because this slots really nicely into a bag, and everyone knows, even with the best laptop bag in the world, you've still got cables coming out of your ears. So this, you can leave the charger at home, you can go away for a weekend, do everything you need to do, just about make it to plug it in when you get home. You already partnered up with Qualcomm on this. How, how serious is the partnership? What else are we looking forward to? So obviously working with Qualcomm, we've created an amazing device for a great price, and it's been fantastic to work with them the whole way through. So this is here in the near future, obviously with Qualcomm throwing out amazing processors all over the place. Our engineers at HQ are working hard to implement those into the next generation of devices, whether that's the traditional mobile phones such as the Zenfone or the ROG phone, or also into larger devices such as the Novago and its, its future successors. And the really important question now, is it out? How much is it? So this is going to be launching on the 12th of October, so tomorrow from tonight. Um, and it's going to be in marketing at 699. With that, you'll get the device, and you'll also get, like I mentioned earlier, the 24 gigabyte SIM card. So if you were to order it on the 12th of October, that'll be in your hands, ready to go and play with, take on all of your adventures by the 19th. So it actually sounds like this could be really popular with students. How big could this be potentially for that market? This could be great for that market, because like I said, you'll be in lectures all day, you can goof off, take it to the student union with you, and Again, it's, it's military rated, it's drop tested, it's cold tested, so you can probably give it a, a fair old bit of punishment in the student union afterwards and you'll still be able to get all your work done, so it's perfect for students. Thank you so much for spending so much time with us, Nate, and talking through your amazing products. Look forward to seeing those out soon. If you like the video, guys, give us a thumbs up, ring the notification bell and hit subscribe to find out when the next videos are. Let us know what you think about these new additions coming out. What's hitting your fancy right now? See you guys later. Bye.